Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi taala wabarakatuh and hi for this presentation we would like to present the final project for the subject IMD 312 reference and information services for information agencies which is video presentation for the purpose of library instruction my group members consist of four people in one group that is Nusna binti Rusani, Izzatuna Bila binti Muhammad Shukri, Roshida binti Asmi, and Nur Idina Shafika binti Muhammad Shafi. Without wasting any time, let's move to the another slide. Let's start it. Before that, what is Easy Access? Easy Access is a web proxy server that allows authorized users to assess IP restricted electronic resources subscribed by UITM libraries such as databases, e journals, and e books. And what about Emerald Insight? Before we get to more knowledge, allow me to briefly explain what is Emerald Insight is called. Emerald is a worldwide publisher that focuses on producing high quality peer reviewed research with a portfolio that includes over 300 journals, over 2,500 books, and over 1,500 teaching examples. Furthermore, this platform was designed from the bottom up in conjunction with renowned worldwide higher education institutions to guarantee that every choice is properly reviewed and approved by users with the goal of making social science research easy and pleasant to find. The innovative designs provides an interesting and gratifying user experience while presenting researchers' work, creating the route for fast development and addressing potential research demands. Emerald Insight may only be available through institutional subscription. Individual or personal subscription pricing is not available from Emerald. If users want to subscribe to an Emerald journal or database on behalf of company, feel free to visit the subscription page for more details. If you are a subscriber and are having difficulty assessing information that you believe you must become capable of seeing, please check the guidelines of the off-campus access is available. Emerald Publishing Limited is a scientific publisher of management, business, education, library studies, healthcare, and engineering journals and books. Emerald Insight provides journal-related components as with browsing out e-journal collections or learning how to publish in a journal, whereas a book provides a long-term archive of a few of the world's most significant issues and case studies, Open Access provides specialized case information from and about developing economies, expert briefings, and innovative publishing services. Among the proof that Emerald Insight is credible and trustworthy is that it has a clear purpose of a fairer society and that's passionate about collaborating with scholars worldwide to produce results. So, how to access the Emerald Insight website? Truth from Easy Access? Okay, first thing first, you need to open your internet browser, examples Google. In the search box, type Easy Access. Then, click Library Easy Access UITM at the top and then it will bring the user to the UITM Easy Access website. Add the login box, key in your number and password. Normally, the password is your IC number. Don't forget to tick the box, I accept the terms and conditions. This is compulsory or else user cannot access the website. And click submit. As we can see, there are four types of resources we can choose whether it is online databases, ebooks, open access, and e news. Alright, so let's click online databases. So, this is how it looks like when user created databases. The hit number of authority resources, as you can see, a handful of keywords there. On the top right, there's a key to icons that give meanings of an icon. On the left side, will be displayed some materials that can be accessed apart from the online databases. 
At the top, there is an alphabetical list from A to W. At the same time, in the box below, for students who want to specify the search according to the type of format, such as online databases, example, all types of online databases will be displayed. While the another box below is for students who want to find material according to the subject or field they are studying, for example, students choose the education section so the material is listed according to the field. Next, for the search for our online database, this time as we already know, we want to search for Emory Insight, so just click on the letter E. Before that, for the user, don't forget to press expand all the descriptions because it will give a summary of what we are looking for in terms of content and click on the material. Now, we are emerald with pages. Okay, so previously we came from easy access and once we click it, a new tab will pop up and once you see that the address and we can search by either title, auto keyword, ISBN, DOI and many more and there is also an advanced search where you can put more details into the article that you had like to search. So, as of right now, let's use the basic search engine. For example, I am looking for the article of information management. Then, it will take you to the search result page and the most relevant article will appear on the top as you can see here. At the top, it will list the articles that are available and below, there are several other pages that we can click on so that we can choose which article suites of our needs. Okay, let me choose one for the example, Risking Knowledge Management and Information Audit of Risk Management Activities within the Hobart City Council and just click on the title. When we open it, there is some important information that is highlighted in this content as a whole. PDF available and at this page, it will display the abstract, the keyword relevant to the article and also an APA citation for the article. And you can also choose to download the article. Basically, when we need to download, it can download it here. And now we can have access to the actual article in PDF form. And by default, the article will open in about in a browser. And then we can choose to download it here by clicking this button. You can check the file in your laptop or PC, whether it is there or not, the downloaded file. So, it is easy, right? And then, this is done for the first and basic step. Let's move to the another one. Next, I am going to show how users can navigate their search result quickly and easily by narrowing it down or by broadening their search. Firstly, at the searching box, user can write the title, author, keyword, ISBN, or DOI that matches to what they wanted to find. User can search their needed content quickly by using the quick search or also uses the advanced search options. After you have found 
your needed content, user can sort it by its relevance. For instance, user can sort it either from the newest or oldest, or oldest to newest. In Emerald Insight, there is a top-level view for article, chapter, case, and briefing. User can identify with the form of content that they needed, whether it is in article, book part, case study, or briefing. Before reading the full text article, user can read the summary and detail provided, checking the list of author, publication date, and also a quick access link that has been provided such as the HTML and PDF version. User can also check whether they can view the article by looking the access option that are next to the tick box section to see whether the document are available or unavailable to be accessed and read. For example, this article content is available to be accessed and read. The box located here shows the article level download count so the user can know whether the article is used a lot. Next is exporting citing information. To download citation information for just one piece of content, click on the journal or article and scroll down to the citation information at the bottom of the page. Click on the individual download where the RIS option which is located under the citation. User can also download bulk citation from the search result by selecting their preferred result and then exporting the citation as required. There are also options to display, either 10, 20 page or 50 result at one time. The tick box located here can be selected to which RIS file user wants to, do, to download. Either it can be one, two or many more. User can also have the option to save the file, open in notepad or send straight to the citation management software. Other than that, user can refine their search result by using the page control to view and scroll through the result. User can also refine their search further by using the options on the right of the screen. Uh, whether to see the access, year of the articles or content that they wanted, the year, and also the content type. User can also preview the content by clicking on the view summary and detail button that will give user an expanded view of the piece of content by the content type, which is the abstract, and also the details to see whether it is up to the user's liking. Last but not least, I will show user how to access the content. Firstly, user need to view the full authors and the affiliations detail. After that, user can go to the full content page of article or journal to download in the available format provided. For example, user can download it in the PDF version or by using the EPUB. Next, user can also jump to the section within the content. For example, in this article, it has the abstract, emotional intelligence. They have also talked about the competencies, methodologies, result discussion, and also conclusions. And the sidebar on the right will show socials related articles from Emerald and other publisher which may be interest for the user. The first one is Quid Search. Quid Search is accessed from the home page. Using MarkLogic powerful search technology to deliver fast and accurate results, search algorithms are set according to user's criteria to retain the most relevant result for the search term. Just enter the words or phrase in the search box and click search. For our example, I types information management. Now we click search and the result is this.
The search bar will remain on the top of the page throughout so that a new search can be run anytime. For example, I type business. After that, the result will be appear. Next is advanced search. The first one, we must select advanced search in the search bar. Select one or more types of content to search across. Next, enter your words or phrase. For example, I type Miss Business. Refine your search by selecting the field in which you wish to search. I choose all fields. Next, click Add Row to add additional search term. Example, I type management. Use the drop down option to access the boolean operator and or not. Next is date range. Narrow your search by date range. You can restrict search result to any content you have access to or just open access content. Click so search to perform your advanced search. Hopefully, you guys enjoy the performance. Thank you so much for and the result will be appear. Just stay with us. Thank you so Many much. Many results of business and management will, will appear to you. After you get off all the results, you must click the title you choose. After that, you must read all the abstracts and you must know the text are available or not. After that, you must click a full tab of journal in PDF. Lastly, check the full PDF and then you can click download. Save into your laptop for the quick search and advanced search. So here is the interface of Emerald Insight. Here is the navigation bar. And when you scroll down, you can see the search engine. So for the search engine, you can do a basic search where you can search by title, author, and many more. And there's also advanced search, but here I'm going to show you how to use basic search. Just type in your information. Click the search button and here you can get your result. There are over 217,000 and you can sort by relevance or newest to oldest or oldest to newest. You can also choose whether you want to access only the content you can have access to or open access in the year. So now I'm going to show you how to use the advanced search. Scroll down and click on the advanced search. So now you can see this is the advanced search. And now you can either click on all Emerald content, either journal articles, book part, case studies, early site, or expert briefings, or you can just choose one. But for me, I am going to choose all Emerald content. So here you just enter your search terms and then this is all fields. Here you can either search all the searchable fields using one query. Next is the title, whether you can search the article's title. Next is abstracts, you can search within the abstract of a content of an item, contributor and the digital object identifier. So now I am going to add row. So here. There is the N or not um, button you can choose. I'm just enter your search item. Scroll down to the date range. So you can choose from what year to what year of articles that you want. And then the access type. So for the access type, we have 
all content, only open access, and only content I have access to, and just click search. So this is all the search results. We have 15,000 results that you can choose from. And this is all of them. And now I am going to choose this particular article. So I can just click on the HTML. It will bring you to this new tab. So over here, you can see um, the article itself. So here is the name of the article, the authors, and the ISSN number, the publication date. And if you scroll down, you can see there's a PDF button. And also the abstracts and all the contents of the article. So, now we're going to click the PDF button. And now you can see the article in a PDF form. That is the name of the article. And the number of page. Here is the refresh button, download button, print button, and also bookmark button. So you can just scroll down, look at the article, if you're satisfied with it. And down here we have the 50 page button, zoom in button, and zoom out button. So, if you wish to download it, just click on the download button. And your computer will automatically download the article. And if you wish to print the article, you can just click on the print icon or button. Save as PDF and just click save. And then, that is basically it.